Strange new world with new things in it. Gel bar, gold, soap. Toothpaste, yo. All the toothpastes. Are you recording? No, I'm not. It just rained yesterday, so it's really nice and cool and breezy today. Huh? Is that right now? Swing? What? I guess so. Some dogs. It's even there. I get the feeling they'll just attack me if I go and pet them. <laughs> Look, you got you got your bananas over there. Large mound of bananas. Yeah. I wonder where he gets them. So we, we've left our driver, driver to fend for himself and go home into the mountains of northern India. We are now venturing onwards. Things going on I'm interesting. I mean, they're all coming out. Whatever. You, you, you know the drill. You come out, you go in, it goes. And now we're going to, uh, to do our first adventure on to the the metro subway station of India. This is our opportunity to learn how this works and all that. So we got a day card for about 150 ru rubies or ru whatever rupees. Yeah. Why does Zelda have to be so close? With the rubies and the rupees and the rupees. So yeah, we got we got our card. It was 150 for the day, or 300 for three three days, and we don't know what we're doing tomorrow. So we just figured we'll just get one day. And tomorrow uh, we're gonna hang around the hotel, uh, Redfort. Oh, Redfort. So it's close enough to use a. Uh, uh, just to walk around. Yeah. Okay, so we'll go far right now. We'll go check out far places for today, and then just chillax. Chillax. Next day, probably not. And then this is the subway. We're down here. Um, the security guard was really nice. It was. It's really nice. He even asked me where I'm from, and he's like, "All right, cool, chill." Everything, everything was really chill. Although it was a little weird that they had to check you to come in here, but with tourism and all that, I uh, terrorism, <laughs> tourism and terrorism and all that. Uh, I suppose I can, uh, you know, whatever. Okay. Or we'll just wait. So once again, Dylan has got us lost. I was like, hey, maybe it's in here. Nah, nah, bro, it's way over there. I blame the bourgeoisie, personally. <laughs> but you can blame me if you want, you know. I, I do, and I always will. Stick, stick to the anti-utilitarian <laughs> propaganda if you feel like it. <laughs> okay, it's not, it's not that big of a loss, but uh, we did do a huge ass circle around the Lotus Temple, and then said, you know what, we've been here before. Let's go back. <laughs> Basically, we asked, we asked the car, and he said go this way, and we got this way, and we asked a, uh, a vendor, and he said go this way, <laughs> so we're going to like try and meet in the middle. middle. <laughs> Somewhere in the middle. See the right one. Okay. See you inside. 
So we got two dudes being very suspicious over here. Yellow shirt and one of the backpacks over there. Um, we're at the Lotus Temple. Lotus Temple. Could be. Hey, what's up, man? What? Leave you. Leave you. Ah, live me. Ah, United States. Alright, so this uh, the structure looks pretty, pretty nice. Yeah, it looks pretty cool, huh? Check out that. It's like a steps. Stuff. That'd be pretty. If you get on top and you can take a picture, that'd be pretty cool. I don't, I don't see anybody over there though, so I'm not sure. If you can. <laughs> You're a celebrity. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, where are they getting all their water from? The Himalayas, I think. They have a ton of water. They love to take pictures. I love that. No, no. I gotta continue walking. Dude, just as a the, uh, thing is smearing down your face. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm sweating too much. That's why I didn't want it. That's, that's mainly why I didn't want it. Mine okay? Huh? Mine okay though? Yeah, you're perfect actually. I didn't, I didn't even get that. Wow, it looks like I'm bleeding. <laughs> I tried, my monopods keep hitting people, I'm like, fuck. How many times have you used it? Twice. Maybe not worth bringing every day. Maybe not.
thing when this car moves. It's taking us a ton of time to get here. <laughs> Between the metro and uh, walking. Uh, whose fault is that? Here's. Oh. 100%. 100%? 100%. Um, I said that maybe, maybe we could uh, have the driver drive us. But, uh, you were like, no, no. We need an adventure. Oh, absolutely, sir. Have an adventure with the right part. Yeah, I have no idea what this is, but it looks nice. Maybe it's just like a little, uh, little house thing. Somebody's, somebody's backyard. Okay, apparently nobody cares about that ambulance. Hell, even in Mexico, everyone stopped in a freeway that was super packed and they made a lane from in between lanes. Everyone moved to the sides and they made a lane right in between. Everyone was like all jerked out of position and they made a one lane through the super crowded highway and everyone was stopped and I saw it come through and I'm like, yeah, that, that's pretty awesome. I didn't think that ambulance was gonna get through. But no, here it's like, nah, fuck it, who cares? Palette from leaf. The palette phone number, that's it, okay? Um, palette phone number. And that's the power phone number right No, there. no, no, it's a train number. It's a train number. It's a train. Okay. Then you have a bus. Yeah, it's oh. a bus. Then you have an hour night bus from <laughs> Delhi, Dharamsala. We'll be getting back to Delhi around <laughs> what time? 12 a.m. Oh. More than 10 o'clock. Oh, so it's terrible. And then we come back. We're going to have to hold the gap of the bus, you know? We're going to have to hold the gap of the bus, you know? We're going to have to hold the gap of the bus, you know? We're going to have to hold the gap of the bus, you know? We're going to have to hold the gap of the bus, you know? We're going to have to hold the gap of the bus, you know? We're going to have to hold the gap of the bus, you know? We're going to have to hold the gap of the bus, you know? We're going to have to hold the gap of the bus, you know? John just called, he said everything's fine. Oh, no tickets? Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Big head, big head. I have a huge head. That is not. <laughs> oh, yeah, I got the hair though. Maybe I should just get one of those or something and wrap, wrap it around. But if you have the hat, then it'll cover your face, give you some sunburn protection. Huh? If you have a hat that would cover your face, give you some sunburn protection. Yeah, that's true. Bad. What are you looking at? Oh shit, that's awesome. Right? Get it. <laughs> I can do... I can do 350. I can do 350. One piece, two piece. Huh? Two piece, one piece. Just one piece. 400 of I can do two, I can do 350. Okay, one piece. 350? Okay. Okay. Sure, no. For the very reason to upload it. I, I'm not uploading. Not I'm uploading not, to put it in I'm a not, different... I'm not uploading anything. To I'm put it in a different place so I'm, it's not on your SD card, Carlos I'm Rubio. I'm storing the data to another storage device medium. Okay, that's what I thought you did. Another storage medium. Oh, I'm spinning. Why would you only get a medium? Why don't you get a large? I'm spinning. Look, here's the lens. No. I'm so mad at you. Don't record me. Okay, so we went to a little bar next door. It's right over there. It's probably next next to the wall. I don't know. And then uh, they had karaoke, and it was... Karaoke. Okay. And it sounded like this. 
<laughs> that's when the girl was singing. See, you think that he's joking, but that's that's a perfect. Song. And then, um, and and then, um, and then the guy was singing, and it sounded like more like. They kept getting too close to the mic, so it. Oh, yeah, it did, it did squeak a little bit. It did squeak. That was okay. No, it's not. Okay. Other than the uh, loud ringing sound. And the drum beat went. And I think, I think Dylan was saying this, but I think it is because we're super dehydrated that we've been sweating all day. Cause fuck, man, I've been drinking water all day. We took like two glasses, tops, two beers between the two of us, two large beers, and fairly tipsy, I think. Yeah, yeah. Not as tipsy as the other drunken video we had in Japan, but fairly tipsy. I think if we had one more, then we would have gotten that there. And we didn't eat that much either. It was just like we had a uh, cashew curry with butter bread. I'm surprised you. Don't... I just I just know it's a curry. But... I mean, they call it uh, kaju with a J. But when I saw their cashews in it, so I was like, okay. That's so pretty nice. good. That's pretty good memory, sir. A corn tortilla because a corn tortilla breaks too easily. It's kind of the middle point between flour and corn tortilla. You get me? I'm gonna pretend, pretend you didn't say any of that. And it's a tortilla, so don't, just don't, don't listen to me. Don't listen to me. It's, it's, it's just a really, you gotta believe it's just me, really Carlos. strong, like, really strong texture tortilla. That's about it. All right. Good. Good job. Now we're going to do a tour on the hotel. All right. It's, it's a pretty sad state of affairs that we're in. Oh, yeah. We, how, how many? Uh, I've, I've killed two roaches. One baby. Two roaches? Oh, yeah. Nice job. Uh, Carl's to kill one. I, I killed one. And, and with Dylan's up, so... Yeah. Okay, okay I, look. I'll call two and a half. Come on. Come come on. Let's, let's go. Let's, let's go to the hotel. We're in the hotel room. Good job. <laughs> okay. So here's the bed. Uh, we're dividing it. We're dividing with the I'm pillows. Sure that we got two beds. I, yeah, I'm pretty sure we got two beds. Like, we had this big debate over, over whether we want to spend the money. But, you know, I'm not going to... Alright, so... So we're putting pillows in, in the middle, and then there you go. Here's the window, and you, and in the nighttime you don't see much, but um, it looks oh, like yeah. there's some trees on the roof and stuff. In the daytime, at least it looks like it's growing off the roof, and then there's people down there. There they say hi, or they're talking, whatever. You know, there's still people out. It's fairly early, but we're waking up fairly early every day, so. By the way, what's going on? My internet is still my Google. Still defaults to google.co.jp because I have not used this thing at all. <laughs> oh shit, so, so Japan? Okay, so they give you chips as well. And uh, that's not anything. Uh, give with uh, give you chips, considering they cost like triple what you get on the street. So, so the, um, yeah, the chips are like. Uh, are you sure? They're like 60 rubies. That's not bad. You know you're right. You're totally right. Okay, they, they do they do um, ch charge it up because because it's hotels they charge you. And then we got we just went out and got some weird chip things of our own. Um, these are okay. They're like bakery cookies. They're they're like they're good. Um, uh -huh. bananas. And then they, you can you can like heat your own water so that you don't drink like. Well, you, you you will drink bad water, but you know maybe you can it can be a little safer. It's if it's um, boiled, and you get two little cups. I've been using one. I cleaned it before I used it, though. Yeah, that's just still in this bag. And then they give you water, but I took them out because I want to put our own water in here. And then I, I bought some juice, and and then we, I got I got some water for like 20 rupees. Whatever, and it's like, it's like 30, 30 cents American, and then, yeah. So, if you leave it for too long, everything freezes. So just watch out for that. And then, you get this little, this little room thing. I don't know. Maybe you can hide things in there. And then you got a closet. Got a little safe here. I, I didn't even realize that. I'm just like exploring as you're exploring. Well, I'm exploring. It's just. So I'm not gonna mess with it. It's probably nothing. 
Um, you also get a um, hair blower um, shampoo that I don't recommend using. Get your own because it'll. If you have long hair like I do, um, you will regret it. Uh, they give you shampoo, uh, soap, and toothbrush and pasta. A uh, little bit of uh, toilet paper. You get a phone. That's that's new. And the fan of death. That you go super fast. That's always cool. Don't jump or hold your hand up because you will lose it. Um, Dylan is um, has a little laundry thing. So don't don't <laughs> don't, <laughs> don't bother with that. I'm. I'm cleaning some sh new new shorts that I have. Dylan said suggested that I clean it, so I'm cleaning it here in the sink because we're backpacking and shit. So I think that's what backpackers do. This is the toilet. Just a square kind of weird toilet thing. And you you piss and then you you poop and then you piss and then here's like instead of a bidet like in Japan, they have a little spray thing. So it's off right now, and then you turn it on, and then you can you can spray your butt, and it's fairly strong. And you can turn it off, and then there's like no real divider here, so it's flat or whatever. Not really flat, but there's whatever. And then this is this is the shower. There's like one drain there, and then when water runs to the other side, there's a dra another drain over there, and a little trash can. And um, so you, you turn it on by just pulling it out. I don't want to pull it right now, so I'll, I'll do it. Fine. So it comes out of here. Then you can push this button up. And it comes out of this hand thing that you can whatever do. And then if you move this to the right, it's cold water. If you move it to the right, it's hot water. And then there's a uh, little thing there for the shower head up top. So if you pull that while the water is running, you'll get water from up top. And there you go. That's about it. Uh, and yeah, there's uh, two fans in there to help with um, the mist and all that. And other, other than that, it's a pretty standard um, room for... I guess Americans? I don't know. I don't know if it's like life of luxury for um, Indian visitors or something. Yeah. But it's like, what, 30 bucks a night? 30 bucks. You mentioned the uh, shower does not, that we have no hot water basically. What? No, I had, wa I had water. We have lukewarm water. No, no, I had super hot water. Do you? I had super fucking hot water here. And I had to turn it down. I was like, fuck. How did you do that? I turned it to the left. To the left. That's the right. Counterclockwise. Show me how you do this. <laughs> I've been taking cold showers for three days. Cold showers are good, Dylan. I mean, they were good when it was hot. Okay, so look, 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 check this out. Check this out. This is cold. This is fucking hot. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hot. Cold. I had to put it here because it, it was like too hot. All right. How do you feel now? How do you feel? I'm feeling a little bit extreme. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and, okay. And we have a TV. I guess I didn't really okay, show I, that. I thought I was gonna get hypothermia from coming out of the shower. <laughs> It's 113 degrees out there, Dylan. Yeah, but the change of temperature is what gives you the hypothermia. I don't... Whatever, man. <laughs> Alright, we have a TV and that's about it. It doesn't work. And there's a mirror. P.S. It comes with the little button there so you can call for, like, a waiter or... Suck dicks! Or something. You can, like, press the button and then someone will come and say, What's up? What do you need? And then you tell them you don't need anything. Because <laughs> that's what we did. <laughs> <laughs>